time, um, I was driving home from work and it was really dark and there was this guy sitting at the stop sign and I was like, dude, what are you doing? And he pulls out and turns his lights off and I'm like, that's weird. And so then I'm driving down the road and there's this guy standing in the middle of the road. I mean, just standing there, like scary movie stuff. And so I drive to my house and I'm like, mom, there's crazy stuff going on. And I don't know, but then they went and checked and he was gone. It was scary. Okay, the time when I was most afraid was when I was a little kid. I had a dream that there was a fish in my bed. And it got really scared because I don't like fish. Alright, the time I was most afraid was when I was about eight years old. I was on a plane out to Utah. And I was sitting between these two guys and they were really, really angry because this baby was crying. And they were like cussing out the mother and getting really angry. So naturally, I thought they were terrorists. So the whole hour and a half, I was just like clenching the armrests and really scary. Uh, last day of kindergarten, I missed the bus and I cried because my mom came to pick me up because I thought that I was just going to be stuck at school for the rest of the summer. So one time I was home alone and I was um, up in my room and out on my roof, I can like get out on my roof, that I had my blinds closed and all of a sudden I look out my window and there's a guy on my roof, like a dude on my roof. I ran downstairs. I ran downstairs and I grabbed like a like a butcher knife and I went and hid in a closet and like and then I called my mom and she was like um, she's like oh yeah there's men coming to work on our roof because of the hail damage so I was most afraid was when I got stuck in a tree I liked to climb things when I was little so I felt like a cat and I got stuck and had to climb my dad had to climb on the ladder and it was just traumatizing.